We begin tonight with a promising future for our national parks and public lands. Colorado Senator Cory Gardner is behind the Great American Outdoors Act, a bill aimed at speeding up needed maintenance in national parks and providing permanent funding for the Land, Water and Conservation Fund. Cary X5's Adrian Thomas joins us live from the monument with more details. Adrian. That's right, Katrin, I'm coming to you live from the Colorado National Monument, arguably one of the most popular pieces of public land here in the Grand Valley. The National, uh, National Monument is, of course, run by the National Park Service. Now, this bill would provide about $2 billion over the next five years to fund much needed maintenance projects in national parks and monuments across the country. U.S. Senator Cory Gardner, who represents Colorado, tells me he's very optimistic this legislation will become law. On Monday, Senator Cory Gardner urged fellow U.S. Senators to pass his Great American Outdoors Act. The Senate voted 80 to 17 to begin debating this legislation, which Gardner says could make a huge difference in national parks everywhere. It's a great chance for us to uh, work on the Land and Water Conservation Fund and to address the maintenance backlog at our national park, places like the Black Canyon and the Gunnison National Parks. Gardner also says this could make a huge impact for local economies near these lands. You were quoted as saying how this would be a job creator. Just how exactly would that happen? Can you elaborate a little bit more? You know, when the first wave of coronavirus went through the United States, so we had some of our Western communities, especially our ski towns that were hit the hardest. But this would put money into maintaining our national parks, into maintaining our national forests, into maintaining our Bureau of Land Management grounds, our Fish and Wildlife Service grounds. And so it's about fixing trails and trailheads, safety. It's about redoing roads uh, through our, our, our public lands. Out on the Colorado National Monument, we asked hikers why they like this place so much and why it's important to protect these lands. The hikes are beautiful. They have it for like every kind of type of like whether you're a beginner or you're an expert, you can kind of do everything. It's just great exercise. We both have retired and live close by. Gloria and Jan have been hiking the monument for 40 years and feel any conservation efforts from the federal government are very important. It's our heritage. All these areas are so beautiful that we have to keep it up for our grandkids. Now, a very interesting fact is funding for this legislation actually comes from revenue generated by offshore oil and natural gas drilling. Senator Gardner told me this was determined because when you're drilling for oil and natural gas, it puts pressure on that, on, on that resource. So it was appropriate to direct those funds to preserving resources on national parks and public lands.